Shalom. Let's talk about the Atal diet, the spiritual connection to food. So welcome back to the channel, Legendary Ross Corey, where we explore rich and vibrant aspects of the Rastafari in life and teachings. Tonight, uh, we're diving into the Atal diet. A lifestyle choice deeply rooted in the Rastafari beliefs. For the next five minutes, I will explore what the Atal diet is, its principles, its spiritual significance. Let's get started. You know, did you know that the food you eat can deeply influence your spiritual well being? Let's uncover how the Atal diet connects spiritually and the nutrition. In this video, we will explore the Atal diet and the lifestyle of the Rastafari beliefs, emphasizing natural foods and spiritual connections to what we consume. What is Atal diet? The Atal diet pronounced I-Tal comes from the word vital, signifying life energy at its core. Atal is all about natural and pure living. This diet is an uh, integral part of the Rastafari uh, way of life, promoting harmonious existing with uh, nature, deep spiritual connection to the food that we consume. Many people struggle with unhealthy eating habits that disconnects them from their bodies and their spiritual self, leading to a lack of harmony into their lives. One of the fundamental principles of Atal diet is um, consuming food in its more or most natural state. You know, this means avoiding processed foods, artificial additives preservatives you know rastafari believe that natural foods are pure and full of life energy you know what i mean the essential for maintaining a healthy body and and the mind so it's really a mind body and spirit you understand so when you live in a rastafari diet and Another key aspect is avoidance of meat, especially pork. Many brethren or Rastafarians um, adapt to a vegetarian or vegan diet, though some may still eat like fish, you know what I mean? The consumption of salt is also limited, and instead, they we use herbs and the natural spices the flavor of the meal so your salts and your seasonings is the flavors of the spices you know the key insight here is how to embrace the Atal diet and how it can transform not just your health but also your spiritual journey you know what i mean promoting mindfulness and um intentionally in every meal the Atal diet is not just about physical health is a deeply spiritual um way you know what i mean rastafari i see food as a gift from the creator meant to nourish both the body and the soul you know understand so by eating natural foods we believe they're aligning themselves with the divine you know what i mean divine energy and maintaining a spiritual connection with or to the earth you know what i mean the spiritual connection to the earth or some people call it source you understand the so itel diet is not um it's one it's in this way the itel diet prom promotes mindfulness and gratitude when preparing and consuming Food that Rastafari often reflect on is, or you go back to its origins, giving thanks for the natural bounty and the uh, the life that it sustains. You know what I mean? 
this practice fosters in a sense of a, a reverence for nature and a commitment to uh, living in harmony with the whole environment. We have discussed the fundamental aspects of the Atal diet and its significance in the nurturing both the body and the spirit, highlighting the importance of the diet or the conscious eating, you know what I mean? So what actually do Rastafari eat or Rastafarians eat? You know, I've been a Rastafarian my whole 20 years of my whole life. And what we eat is like fresh fruits, vegetables that are staples, often grown organically without using any kind of pesticides, used grains instead of rice, digments, um, nuts, and also common providing like an essential nutrients like protein. You know what I mean? The nuts is like really like the good protein and nutrients that you get. The herbs and the spices plays a big significant role in adding flavor without relying on salt. You know, we use coconut milk, fresh juices, herbal teas are really popular in the Rastafari movement. And while some of my brethren and some of my Rastafarian brethren may consume fish, you know, it's usually prepared in a simple, unprocessed manner. The benefits of the Itao diet, you know what I mean? The Itao diet offers a numerous benefits, both in uh, physical and spiritual. You know, by focusing on the whole natural foods, it provides the essential vitamins, minerals, antioxidants, you understand. So that supports the whole overall health and the well-being it also is a sustainable way of eating and encouraging organic farming and reducing environmental um impact if you enjoy the uh, this exploration of our diet you know so you can be sure to check out other videos and on spiritual living and healthy eating, let us know at uh, Legendary Ross Corey. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe, hit the channel, hit the like button, and share. Shalom in the home, Rastafari.